work for North East Lincoln Council on a, a new programme that started, uh, my role did anyway, just coming up to two years ago now, um, where I work in the community with the long-term unemployed local people, uh, trying to remove some of the barriers that's preventing them from getting back into work. The name of the programme is the Change Programme. Um, what we set out to do is work with local people, trying to get them back into employment, uh, taking them off the benefits system, uh, but also working with local employees to create um, jobs um, within our local area of North East Lincolnshire. We've had good successes, uh, but we've also had a, a really high rate of people who want to become engaged with us. Um, some people stay with us long term, some people are there short term, but it's all people who want to get back into work. Uh, and there is a high proportion of them people come from the East Marsh area. When we meet a lot of people, there is organisations, uh, and a lot of organisations in North East Lincoln that work together. However, it's making the local community aware of these organisations. I've lived here now for over 15 years, and there's organisations that I'm still finding now that I wasn't aware of. So when we attend in the East Marsh area, places like Your Place, Rock Foundation, we work with Contract Links that work within um, the East Marsh area. That's just to name a few but to get the community out using these venues and engage with these people, I picture that as part of the big society. It does work. People are more comfortable attending in, in their own area to an organisation rather than having to get on a bus or travel within the community um, for 10, 12 miles, wherever it is, to a different organisation. Unfortunately, that can't be helped sometimes. But that's what I see as, as our role, and that's what we try and do within our change programme. I'd like to tell you about one story in particular. Uh, this gentleman uh, was engaged on the change programme early on. Um, he had previous convictions, uh, he was in his 50s, uh, didn't believe he would get back into work, uh, was very dedicated, however, just didn't know where to go. Uh, we actually got him into some voluntary work to start with that he enjoyed. It got him out of the house, got him engaged within the community on his, on his area. Uh, he felt it was improving the area that he lived in, so it took a, he had a real uh, kick out of uh, attending. This then led to him going on to uh, what we call a, an ILM, which is an independent labour market, six-month uh, working scheme where he gets paid for, for that work. That alleviated the problems that he had with bills, uh, paying his mortgage, uh, got him off benefits, uh, got him active, got him addressing his health issues and his mental health issues, uh, got him having a better home life. After that six month, he was then taken on and he's now a, a supervisor for the same company, but he's also then spreading the message to the younger people and the other people that are coming onto that scheme. Uh, and he is, I would call him an ambassador. And, and I, just, I just think that's fantastic because it's, probably 12 months ago now where he was really on a, a low and didn't think anything would work out anymore. Uh, and now he's applying for new roles, new jobs. He wants to get into uh, educating people if he can. Um, so the, yeah, I think that's a, a, a real, real good show of how the change programme works, but how people can help themselves as well, which is, that's the important part, them wanting to help and improve themselves. <laughs> My main role is to get people into uh, employment, but it's also helping people along the way, getting them into education, making them feel better about themselves. Uh, and if that improves the poverty and deprivation within our area and lifts the whole of North East Lincolnshire, uh, and what we're talking about is East Marsh area, then I think that's got to be my vision. It's to see people chatting over the back fence and, and feeling good about where they live again and the area as a whole is lifting up. And hopefully that can lead to um, other people coming into the area, maybe it's companies creating further jobs and as keep going and, and lifting the whole area as a whole. <laughs>